Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching. I'm um, sorry about another video today, but I remembered um, there was some other news that happened yesterday that got overshadowed by the shooting and the 93 million Americans who sadly lost their lives yesterday and today. Let's have a moment of silence. So yesterday, uh, Governor Paul LePage of Maine um, signed a bill, which was LD9, that prohibits uh, gun registrations. No firearms registry in Maine. It is now law. Um, this was a direct response to question three that was on the ballot last year in Maine, which was backed and funded by Michael Bloomberg and Moms Demand Action and uh, Every Town for Gun Safety, blah, blah, blah. Um, Michael Bloomberg's groups tried to institute background checks in between like a person to person gun sales you know the people who already have had background checks to get the gun in the first place uh selling it to another uh owner another person a, pre a potential owner in Maine and many people not just in Maine but nationwide believed that that was going to be the precursor um uh, for national gun registry and the good thing is that uh most all of the uh um the legislators in Maine agreed too because it passed the House 122 to 24 and it passed the Senate 35 to 0. So, uh, way to make a statement, Maine. I'm glad our, there are pro gun states here in New England, you know, where it all started. Now, of course, the crybabies came out in droves saying that it's going to be harder t for the police to track stolen guns. Well, if they're stolen and they haven't been found, then they're not tracking them anyway. And um, it's going to be harder for the police to comply with court orders. No. It's not. You follow the court order. And the good thing is that everybody seems to be on the same page, that this uh, stunt by Bloomberg was a precursor to, um, to threaten state and the state constitutions and the federal constitution. Uh, so I'm glad that people are waking up. Just some quick info. Um, also, I have a question for my viewers. Um, I'm floating an idea of uh, doing the first collaboration uh, with the Liberty Doll. Um, she is another uh, YouTuber who runs a uh, blog. Uh, she's well known. She's got a growing channel. She's also here in Massachusetts, which I didn't know. Um, but to my viewers, uh, would you be interested in uh, a collab between me and her? And, uh, well, her and I? And if so, well, give me some ideas. Never done one. Um, I'd be interested to hear your thoughts. Uh, if you would like to see a collab with Liberty Doll and uh, how we would um, do it. <laughs> Give me some ideas. Uh, I appreciate all of your uh, input and I look forward to the responses. Till we see each other again. This is Jared from Guns and Gadgets. It's getting late. Be safe. Stay vigilant. Carry a weapon. Yes. Yes. Look. Uh, even kicking back in the chair. Carry a weapon. Take care, everybody.